Benoni Defense, Modern, King's Pawn Line, 6, G67.F3BG78.BG5H69.B30010.QD2. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. Both players navigated the middle game well. Both players had incredible precision in the end game. Opening with the Queen's Pawn. The Indian game begins by controlling the important e4 square with the knight, rather than a pawn. By taking control of the crucial d5 square and creating a space on which the knight can move to c3 without obstructing the c-pawn, move c4 helps to create a strong center. With the help of the king's Indian defense, white can get ready to develop the bishop to g7 and create a powerful center that black will later try to damage. F3 weakens white's kingside and the e3 square while preparing the e4 pawn advance and removing the g4 square from black. This uses a pawn to attack the center while vying for position. By positioning the bishop on a potent diagonal, this fianchettos the bishop. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. It is ideal. The bishop is prepared to grow into a functional square. It is ideal. The bishop will be better off as a result of this. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. h6 forces the bishop to decide, exchange or retreat. The bishop is now in a secure position. This activates a queen by developing it off of its starting square. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. Recaptures. Games Master. It is the final book action. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. It is ideal. This would be a missed chance to move a piece to safety. It is incorrect. There were worse maneuvers, but there were also much better ones. It is incorrect. The pawn is now in a safe position. It is ideal. It's alright. That's good. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This is a missed chance to stomp on a bishop. It is incorrect. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. This reveals an assault and puts a pawn in danger. It is ideal. Now that the rooks can see one another, they can defend one another. It is quite good. In comparison to the right pick, this is the incorrect piece to capture with and results in a loss of content. That falls flat. This misses a chance to win back a piece. That falls flat. This loses a pawn. There was only one good move there. It is a blunder. There was only one good move in that position. This ignores an opportunity to win a pawn. It is a miss. Although black lost their advantage, the game is still almost evenly matched. It is incorrect. Backs off. It is ideal. That's a decent move. That's good. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. There was only one move that was effective, and this wasn't it. It is incorrect. The rooks are coordinated and powerfully doubled on the file. This threatens to win a queen. It is excellent. This leads to losing a pawn. There was only one good move there. This overlooks an opportunity to win a tempo by threatening a rook. It is a mistake. That was a great move and very hard to find. This is the only good move. It is brilliant. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This passes up the chance to capture an outpost with a bishop. It is incorrect. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. Recaptures. It is ideal. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. It is ideal. After all captures, 
This is an equal trade. This is the only good move. It is best. Backs off. This poses a fork piece threat. It is ideal. By posing a threat to a knight and compelling it to flee, this wins a tempo. It is ideal. This defends a knight that was under attack and had no defenders. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This misses a chance to threaten a knight and gain a tempo. It is incorrect. This is the only good move. This threatens to kick a knight. It is a great move. This attacks a knight, winning a tempo when it moves away. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. The knight is now adequately defended. This is the only good move. This threatens to kick a knight. It is a great move. It was a free pawn there. This poses the risk of producing a passed pawn. It is ideal. This kicks an opposing knight. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. By posing a threat to a knight and compelling it to flee, this wins a tempo. It is ideal. This misses a chance to make a rook attack known. It is incorrect. As a result, a knight who was in danger of gaining material is now gone. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. Backs off. White is equal at this point in the end game. It is ideal. This divides up parts by launching multiple attacks at once. It is ideal. This steps away from the checking knight. This is the only good move. It is a great move. That pawn was available for free. A passing pawn could be promoted as a result of this. It is ideal. Among the best actions. It is quite good. A passed pawn can attempt to advance while being defended by a rook placed behind it. A passing pawn could be promoted as a result of this. It is ideal. This is the only move that works. This stops the opponent from being able to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is a great move. The knight is thus brought to safety. It is ideal. This shifts the bishop to a square with more activity, giving it greater scope. This poses the risk of producing a passed pawn. It is ideal. This forks multiple pieces. This threatens to take an open file with a rook. It is excellent. The pawn is now in a safe position. This poses the risk of producing a passed pawn. It is ideal. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. This turns the pawn into a passed pawn, which means no other pawn may oppose it as it advances. It is ideal. An opponent's passed pawn can't advance if a rook is positioned behind it. It is ideal. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. This protects the bishop who was attacked. It is ideal. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is quite good. The bishop is currently located at an outpost, a safe square within the opponent's domain. It is quite good. By moving it from the back rank, this activates the king in the end game. It is quite good. It was a free pawn there. It is quite good. A wise decision. It is quite good. This positions the rook behind an enemy passed pawn, preventing it from pushing for promotion. It is quite good. Very precise. It is best. A passed pawn is pushed by this. That's good. A powerful play. It is quite good. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is excellent. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. The opening was balanced. Both players navigated the middle game well. Both players had incredible precision in the end game. 